girl's about to be like, hey, hey, hey. feeling myself. Oh, oh, okay. Ooh, that's a look. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a good day because I know that I am. Um, so today's video is going to be part two of my Shein haul review. If you guys haven't seen that video, you guys should pop over and watch that one. I do want to apologize because I cut it very quickly, but I was having too much video footage and I had to cut it somewhere, so I'll make sure I get better at that for next time. I made sure that I got a measuring tape so I can pop in my measurements for you guys here. So yeah, without further ado, let's get to it. This is a corduroy skirt. Oh, let me get the, the actual name for this. So this is called buttoned up, uh, whoops. <laughs> this is called the buttoned up cord skirt. It was $10 and in the picture, it looks more brown in the picture like on my phone, but in real life, it's more of like an orangey brown. Don't like, don't, don't like come for me because I don't know my colors that well. I'm just trying to explain to you guys the best way that I can. And it buttons like all the, like all the way. You just like can wrap it around. And oh no. I'm saying oh no because I bought this in a small and it's tight. <laughs> it's tight. Like really tight. Like if I like push out. <laughs> Jeez, yeah. F my life. Okay, so, but we're gonna try. I'm gonna try because I really I really felt like I could pull this skirt off. I'm liking it. I'm really sad that it's a size too small. Um but your girl hit in the gym, so maybe I might be able to slim this waist up. I'm just kidding. I don't understand how I ended up buying this in a small and I bought everything else in a medium. It must have just, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. It probably was an accident because I'm pretty sure I ordered everything else in a medium. But you guys, I'm really, I'm really like, I'm really liking this. I think it's super cute. You know what? I think I have a black top. This is their lettuce edge crop top. Um, I don't have a bra on right now, but I definitely should have one on. The material. Okay, it's very cheap. It's very cheap. And it makes me a little bit sad. It's not the worst thing that has touched my skin, but obviously it's not the greatest. Um, little upset I paid $8 for it, but you know, just from looking at it, it's pretty cute. Like if I seen this top on another girl, I definitely would be like, that is super banging. Where can I get one of those? Like, I think it's cute. And I'm still digging this skirt, even if you guys aren't digging it. This is called the Backless Metallic Plunge Cowl Slit Dress. That is a mouthful of words. I bought this dress because the model was giving me, like, everything in the picture. Like, she just looks so banging. And I was like, I definitely could wear this out, like, to the club. And another reason why I bought it is because it was $6. And I was just like, I had to see. I had to see if it was, if it was gonna be like everything. I was like, $6, like no way. Like honestly, I really feel like this dress isn't gonna do it, but I have like a little bit of faith. I've got some faith that this dress might, might do it, it might. Oh God. Oh, go, oh, okay. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you guys. So I'm gonna just have to say like, no. It could be like that I got this in a size small, like, mate, oh my God, the, okay, whew, let me calm down. Okay, no, just no. So I should have ordered this in a medium. I really thought that it was gonna be too much like material in this area, that it wasn't gonna be cute, so I bought it in a size small. And I thought there was only one slit in it, but there are two slits and it shows pretty much everything. Like I'm pretty sure you guys can see my bum when I turn around. And from the, like from the side, okay, yeah, you guys can probably see too much. I'm just gonna hold that. Like, it just does, 
like nothing. I don't think this is flattering on me. It may be flat, like maybe on somebody else whose figure is like super banging. I don't know. You guys let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. But definitely, definitely not feeling this dress. So we're going to hurry up and get out of this because I don't like it at all. Um, okay, so the next thing that I got. Oh, yeah. Okay, so these are Palazzo pants. Um, I was actually super excited about these. Okay, so I went ahead and put this crop top back on because, well, I can't get, I can't show you guys pants with no top on. So let me grab my step stool. Okay, you guys, you guys still can't even see how long. Let me step on my bed. Ooh, I'm asking to die right now. These pants are long enough. I'm so glad I bought this in a large and it's not like it's not too big. I was worried that I might have to have it taken in. I need to get off there before I plummet to my death. I was worried that I might have to take these pants in at the waist because I bought them as a large and I only bought them as a large because I wanted them to be long enough but they fit very well. Um, I like them. I think the stripes are super flattering. I could definitely get away with wearing these with heels, which I'm happy about. The only thing that I, what was I just about to say? I don't like the little um, shorts inside. I don't think you guys can really see them through. Well, you might be able to. Um, I might just cut, cut it out. Like I'm definitely gonna have to go into the sunlight and um, see um, if the sun shines like through, you can see all the goodies or not, but like these are super cute. And, um, these were $20 and I'm like, I'm loving them. I think they're so cute. I think they look very flattering on me. I'm definitely liking them. I wish that my bum looked a little nicer. Uh, you guys probably can see in these, like, not that it looks terrible, but I just wish that it popped like a little bit more, but Oh well, it's not that big of a deal. I still think that these are very cute um, and I'm very, I'm really happy with these. Like, really, like, these pants are winning right now. Definitely like, ooh, that's a look. No, I'm kidding. But yeah, I really like these. So, yeah. So this is their halter neck open back bodysuit. This was $6. Um, I just don't really have, like, like, I have one bodysuit, and it's what I was wearing earlier, the green one. Like, that's a bodysuit. That's the only one I own. Like, no lie. And I was just like, you need to get more bodysuits. Yeah. Like, this is definitely super cute. Something that I would wear, you know, like I said, with, like, some Converse on or just any tennis shoes, really. Um, you could definitely dress this up if you wanted to, but I would probably wear it just like this. I think it's super cute. Um, very, like, summertime feel. It's not summertime, it's wintertime, but I live in sunny California, so our summer's still like 70, 80 degrees in some places, so I could definitely get away with wearing this. I like it. It's super soft. It feels great. I, like I said, the v-neck, super flattering. Yeah, I think it's super cute. Women, basics, man. You guys should see my floor right now. There's clothes everywhere. Okay, so this top right here is called the tie-dye print halter neck top. Honestly, I ordered it because it had a sun and a moon on it, and I'm, like, super obsessed with the moon. Like, if, so, if there's a moon on something, I'll bite. Like, I really have a problem. Yeah. This right here, this is cotton. This feels amazing. Amazing. It's very stretchy. It's got that spandex in it, too. I really thought this was going to be, like, one of those stiff t-shirts. I don't know how to... You guys, I gotta get better at trying to articulate what I mean. Okay, so this is, you see like this one is not, it's not flowy. Like it's just like, it is what it is. Like it's not, it's not flowy, it's not cotton. I actually really like this top. The only other top I have that looks like this is the one that I showed you. Um, and like I said, I thought it was gonna be like much more sturdier. I don't know. Anyways, much more like structured. I didn't know it was going to be like a soft cottony material. Um, I'm not like, I'm not mad that it's not. It's very soft. I do like that. Um, I think it looks very cute. Just throw this on with some jeans. I like it. Moving on to the last couple tops that I have. Um, this one, it says, I'm a happy go lucky ray of fucking sunshine. And I felt like it suited me. 
because I am hyper, you guys. I'm very hyper, and I have to consistently, like, tell myself to chill out. Oh, okay, no, it is, like, a crop top. Okay, I thought I was wrong. Um, but, yeah, this is just what it looks like. Um, like, it's cool. Um, I probably wear it. I'm not even gonna lie. It's cute. It's cute top. I just think maybe the the crop like it could also be the jean. But honestly, I like to wear like mid waist or um, high waisted jeans. I think they look very flattering on women. Um, and so I guess maybe if these jeans were like a little bit lower, it might be a little bit cuter. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. Like, it, it's not ugly. It's not bad. I like it. I think I'll definitely wear it. Um, it's it's meh. It was five dollars. Like you know, you can't really you can't really be mad. Like, it's, it's straight. It's whatever, I guess. I'll probably wear it. Not even gonna lie. Like, but yeah, you guys let me know what you think about this top. Thumbs up, thumbs down. This is the strappy halter neck fitted t-shirt. Oh, maybe it's a t-shirt. I don't know. I thought it was a, um, well, I thought it was a bodysuit or, did I say halter? Whatever I said. You guys, I'm losing my marbles. I need help. It has these, like, if you guys can see this, it has, like, these, oh, what am I doing? Okay. Like the seam, like where the where the boob should go. I really don't like that. I don't think that's flattering when it's like, looks like booby cups. You guys know? Like booby cups. I don't like that. I like stuff to be like seamless, just, you know? But we're gonna put it on. We're gonna see this tomorrow. But that's not flattering. Like, that's not cute. Do you guys know what I mean? Like, that's not cute. But, Aside from that, I think the silhouette of this top is super cute. It's very soft. I love the, the length of these sleeves. I prefer long sleeves. I don't know, I'm really weird about sleeves. Like I like them to be long. Um, and I definitely like that about this top. I like the crisscross in the front. I think that's very cute. Um, I feel like my boobs look very nice in this top and I also like that. Um, it's just like um, a straight across cut in the back so it looks like just a regular off the shoulder top. I like it. Okay, and I think I have, yeah, I have one more top. And I'm actually pretty excited about this top. So I'm just going to put that on. And I have, I have a pair of leggings too. So I'm just going to put them on together. Okay, so these are the last two articles of clothing that I have. These camo print leggings and this like skeleton hand top. Um, the top is called Skeleton Handprint Lace Up Cami Top, and this was $7. And then the leggings are just the camel print, um, tape side leg, tape aside leggings, and these were $6. So what drew me to this top was the skeleton hands. I thought that they were really cool. Um, I like that it looks like they're holding your boobs. Um, I think it's pretty edgy. I thought it was really cute. I had to stop recording for a second to figure out how to do up this shirt because you have to like lace it in the in the back. So it pretty much the straps go from the brunt from the brunt what from the front and then you just bring it down and you have to like crisscross it through and it ties at the bottom. The string is too long and I honestly don't like that, but. Um, I think the back is very cute. Um, I think it makes it a little bit sexy even. Um, so I would probably just cut the string in the back of this just because I just feel like that's not cute. Now onto these leggings. They're flexible, but it just feels a little tight around the thigh area if you guys know what I mean. Um, the waist, it does seem like a little bit too big, but I don't think I could get away with a small in these and also the length, I don't know. Um, I'm sure the small is shorter in length than these ones, um, but if you don't care about the length, um, then definitely these these might work for you. They were six dollars, not a bad price for leggings. You know, a lot of them run five to six dollars. Um, these are also soft. I think these are that same rayon material. Um, I think they're cute. I wish the leggings were just a little bit longer, but they feel nice. I like that that soft material. The last thing I got, um, it ended up, it came earlier than everything else, so I did unpackage that one because it came by itself. This um, is one of those cape type jackets. Um, that was gonna be like a trench coat cape type jacket. There we go, gosh, I couldn't, couldn't get it out. And I thought that it was gonna be really cute. It's not bad. Um, 
it's like a mixture of like polyester and rayon. Um, it's not a bad material. It feels, it has like a really slick lining inside, so it feels really soft on the skin. I just think for me personally that it's not as cute as I thought it was going to be on me. Like, I don't know. It's pretty long. Um, it goes past my knees. Um, and I, I, I don't know. I, I thought it would be cool. Like, oh, it's kind of like a cave, kind of like a trench coat. I thought it was going to be super cute. Um, it probably would be cuter if I had like a dress on or something, but yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. Um, I'm kind of on the fence about it a little bit. Like it could be cute. I just like, I think it'd be one of those things where when you wear a piece that you're like unsure about, you kind of just have to own it. And I think if I wore this, I definitely have to just own it. Like, you know what? I'm cute. Like I just have to rock it that way. Um, I think that's how a lot of people give off vibes about certain outfits that you're like, that's cute, but I don't know if I would wear that. Like, you just got to rock it with confidence. And I think that's probably how I would have to rock this piece. This was the last thing I got. Like I said, the other two things that were shipping from New Jersey still haven't gotten here yet. So if I end up adding the clip in, that means that they made it in time. I am going on a trip on Tuesday next week. It's Monday right now, and I have to work the next day five days so I don't know if I'll have time to like film it so if they make it in they make it in if they don't not a big deal hey guys so it is Thursday which means my package did come I opened it just because I was really excited and I wanted to see what was in there and so yeah I opened it anyways so yeah there was only two articles in it and yeah I'm just gonna put them on <laughs> so the first thing that I got was this red jumper and I don't really own too many, so I was like, gotta get, gotta get some jumpers, you guys know? So let me get the name of this. I did order this in a medium. This is their, this is the crisscross dual v-neck slit side sweater, and this was $16. So the first thing I noticed, like out of the bag, it seems extremely soft, so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop it on. Okay, so this is just the jumper on. It's a little bit baggy. I kind of wish I ordered this in a size small, but it's not really that big of a deal. You could definitely rock it like off the shoulder. It's still cute. Another thing I don't really like is that the, the sleeves are like overly like baggy. There's like an excess of fabric here. It's not like a make or break type of deal, but I kind of like things to be a little bit more fitted, so not my favorite part. Um, it is crisscross in the back, which I think is very cute. And it's just, it's kind of oversized, so I like it. I think it's cute. When I first put it on, though, the fabric, it feels soft, like, when I rub it against my skin. But when I just, like, put it over my head, it did feel a little itchy on my skin. So for those of you who have very sensitive skin, um, may not want... Um, may not want may not like that that feeling it can get a little bit irritating but overall I think this is a very cute sweater um, just rock it with some jeans I like it no complaints really I think it's cute and the last thing that I got was a tweed skirt and I don't really own a lot of skirts honestly and um, I don't own anything tweed either so I thought it'd be cute to get it I ended up ordering this inside in a size large um, just to make sure everything fit. This is their zip back tweed skirt and this was $13. Um, the material seems pretty nice. Like I kind of don't like the all the colors going on. I thought it was like black and white but I guess I was wrong so I'm just gonna put this on for you guys and let you know how it fits. Okay so this is the skirt on it has a slick lining on the inside so it feels really nice on your legs um, I think it stops at a great length the material feels really nice um, I'm glad I bought in a large it fits around my waistline which is 26 inches um, and it feels a little tight on my hips um, my hips are 37 inches and there's this weird like pooching or bunching of fabric in the front that I don't necessarily like. I think it is because the skirt has pockets. I like the fact that it has pockets, but I don't really like that. I guess you can kind of like get away with it if you pull the skirt down, but there's still like, there's still a small ripple there. So I don't really like that that much, but overall I do like this skirt. 
Um, I think it's very cute, and I'm glad that I bought it. I'm glad that I took a chance and got something different. So that wraps up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more content, um, stay tuned. You guys can always drop names for other online sites that you guys want me to review for you. So yeah, I hope I see you guys next time. Enjoy the rest of your day, evening, whatever's going on in your life. I will see you next time. Bye.